Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the Head Falconer and welcome back to another sunny, gorgeous, glorious day here in Wales. And yes, we do get them. It doesn't always rain here in Wales. Uh, so another sunny day means uh, we're out with Hulit. The reason we're doing this, this is just off the cuff, this one, is because uh, after the last video, we had a few people kind of comment saying, why is my owl awake? Uh, isn't the sun hurting his eyes? Well, first of all, he's awake because he's imprinted, uh, other words, hand reared. So he's an African spotted eagle that was brought up by humans in the UK. Uh, so if I'm awake, he's awake. If, he's, if I'm asleep, he's asleep. But also, look at these lovely colours of his eyes. I don't know if it's come up clear on the phone. Uh, I didn't bring my cameras out because, like I said, this is off the cuff. So hopefully you can see it. So he's got yellow eyes. So that traditionally means he is a daytime owl. Naturally flies through the day. Uh, it doesn't mean he can't fly at night time because obviously if you haven't caught anything through the day and you're hungry, you're going to fly at night time. But his natural time is daytime. Uh, so, uh, sorry, I'm out of breath. Uh, say another walk again, two mile up the hill. I'm on the way back down now, uh, so bear with me. So, for the people that are concerned about his, his sun hurting his eyes or him being awake because he's an owl, uh, he's only supposed to be asleep right now. It's not it's not the fact of this. But also, things like nighttime owls, barn owls and tawny owls, again, imprint them. They're awake when we're awake and sleep when we're asleep, and it doesn't, the, the sun doesn't harm their eyes. Their pupils react so much quicker than ours. It's absolutely amazing to see. I might even show you that in one of the videos. So, thanks for the messages, thanks for the comments, uh, but don't worry. Uh, we're not doing him any harm whatsoever. In fact, actually, he's doing the world a good. Because a few days ago, doing this, uh, if he saw like a buzzard or a kite, he would get a little bit scared, a little bit wary. But on the way up here, we spotted a uh, sparrowhawk. Well, he spotted the sparrowhawk before I did. I spotted a sparrowhawk and we spotted several buzzards and several kites. Didn't bother him now. So these walks are actually doing him the world of good. It's getting him used to seeing things again after being uh, with the restrictions due to uh, bird flu here in Wales. Uh, he's so used to now his Avery and our little flying ground that we train on, that uh, getting them back out again, seeing different sights and sounds, oh, excuse me, helps him out lovely. So these walks are actually doing him the world of good. And to be honest, they're doing me the world of good. Doesn't feel it right now, but they're doing me the world of good, getting ready for the season again. So please don't worry about who like being out through the day. If you've got any other comments or questions, just ask, ask away. Uh, it's always good to hear uh, different people's point of views or different people's opinions or questions that, that might have not covered in the video that you are interested in. Let us know and I'll endeavour to uh, answer, but also I'll uh, try my hardest to get videos that you would like to see. Uh, we are busy filming, well, filming right now, but we are busy filming new uh, stuff for the website or new stuff for the uh, uh, YouTube channel. Sorry, I must tell it a breath. And, uh, we're, we're going to do things like training from day one. Uh, so we're busy filming and training things like uh, our Kessel Toby and so on. So the weighing, the manning, so on. And we're going to make a few videos up for you. Uh, we've also got a few uh, mates coming up over the next month or so. So they'll be doing some videos for us and filming with us as well uh, with the birds. So some new uh, content for you. And again, we're pushing the, uh, the car. If you haven't seen it, the RC car uh, and our lures with cameras. So please do uh, watch. Please do stay tuned. As always, if you haven't subscribed, please do be the first to see the videos uh, because more subscribers we get, obviously, uh, more likely we're going to keep the channel going. So please do subscribe if you haven't. But fingers crossed, that's cleared a few things up for you guys. Uh, it doesn't harm the owl being out through the day at all because he is, like I said, a lovely, lovely, oh, sorry, lovely son. He is a lovely uh, after spotted eagle owl, very friendly, imprinted, and I say it doesn't harm him at all being out here. Uh, so hopefully that's cleared up. But if I don't see you guys again, uh, if you haven't subscribed, please do. And uh, well, enjoy the rest of the day. I'm going to enjoy my walk back down the hill now. So love the downhill, better than up the hill. I'm going to enjoy the walk back down, enjoy the uh, the sunshine, and uh, hopefully see you guys again soon. Cheers.